Hi everyone. Welcome to Frappe School. My name is Lynette Sheren and this is the 12th chapter in our advanced accounting course. By the end of this chapter, we will be able to understand how we can manage payment requests in ERP Next. Unico Plastics has some customers who have been given a due date for their payments and are about to reach that date. As a subtle reminder and also to make it easier for the customer not to miss their deadline and pay efficiently, a payment request can be made. These requests can be easily tracked in ERP Next. Let's see how it can be done. Our customer has almost reached the deadline for making their payment. We need to make sure that we have the appropriate sales invoice or sales order against which we can raise this payment request. Let's navigate to a sales order and create a payment request. Against the sales order, the payment request is generally made to get advance payment from the customer. We can select the payment request type to invert since we have to receive the payment from the customer. If the payment had to be given to us through a purchase order, then the type would be set to outward. Next, we can add a transaction date and set the payment mode. The party details and transaction details will be fetched from the sales order itself. Once done, move to bank account details. Here, we can add our bank details and the customer can make the payment there. Once these details are added, we can click on save and submit. This will send an email reminder to the customer and the details that have we have configured. Previously, we saw how a reminder for the request of payment can be made. Well, won't it be more helpful if there would be an option to make the payment through the reminder itself? For this, we have a payment gateway configuration in the payment request document. Let's check that out. Open a payment request via a sales invoice and add all the necessary details. We'll then move to the recipient message and payment details section where we can select the payment gateway account. Once selected, the payment gateway details below will fetch all the pre-created data. Once all the details are added, save and submit the payment request. ERP Next has a host of integrations available for the payment gateways widely used. If you are also using one of these services, you can easily integrate your Payment Gateway account with your ERP Next account. This brings us to the end of the 12th chapter of our Advanced Accounting course. I hope this helped you understand how we can manage to send payment requests to customers who are due to pay in a few days. You can read more about ERP Next on docs.erpnext.com. In the next chapter, we will discuss Dunning. Thank you.